Alright, hello everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Playing Rank. Today, we're going to be playing and ranking Frost Rose and Shrimp Imp, but that'll be in the next video. So Frost Rose is a little different from the regular Rose because instead of just shooting like this regularly, she can actually charge up her shots to deal more damage. And I think her projectiles also do a little bit of splash damage because as you can see, I'm not hitting the zombie directly, but I'm still doing... I'm still doing damage to it. Yeah, here's another example. I'm not hitting the zombie, but I'm still I'm still doing damage to it. And because she's a frozen variant, she has the freeze effect. Other than that, I haven't really noticed anything special about Frost Rose. All right, anyways, with all that said, let's go into a game. Okay, we got Great White North, which is kind of fitting because, you know, Frost Rose is frozen. I'm going to see if I can hit that engineer up there. Oh, nice. I got I hit him. And I got an assist on him. Nice. I really like Rose's homing ability. It's really helping out with this. Oh, that is a lot of potato mines. How are you not dead? I thought you set off those potato mines. Oh, wait. He probably just shot the potato mines. Uh, there's some more zombies over here. So I guess I could help out with killing them. Okay. You might be kind of low. Never mind. You're dead. Ooh, imp. You're definitely low. I just hit you for 50. Nice. Oh, the zombies are capturing. I should probably help out with making them not capture. Let me see if I can kill this Captain Deadbeard over here. He's trying to be all sneaky, but I see him. I have a feeling... Oh, okay, never mind. I thought that Captain Deadbeard was going to go into its barrel and try to kill me. Alright, opening up the gnome area, I see. I might as well collect the gnome. I mean, I've already glitched into the gnome room, so it doesn't really matter. But, uh, I guess it's still nice to have the gnomes. Oh, you're trying to heal. That's not good. What if I were to do this? What would you do then? Okay, you're just gonna run away. Okay, this cone head needs to die because I really don't want it capturing the point by itself. Oh, where did that... Where did that scientist come from? Oh, they're coming from up here. I'm just gonna charge up my projectile and see if I can hit anyone with it. Preferably that all-star. Ah, oh, damn it, I didn't hit it. Please heal me. I'm low. Please heal me. Please. 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 Thank you. Ooh, Captain Deadbeard. Hopefully he doesn't see me. Okay, he's gotta be low. Never mind, he's dead. We've only got 50 seconds left on the timer. We could probably defend this. Also, I've just realized that I haven't been making use of all of my abilities, so I might as well do that. Oh no, we were so close to defending it. Oh, actually, maybe. Could we do this? Never mind. Oh, I was, wasn't was expecting you to do that. Okay, random thing I've noticed. I feel like... Frost Rose's projectiles might travel slightly faster than regular Rose's projectiles. I'm not too sure about that though, but I just had a feeling that they did. We've got about 10 seconds left on the timer, but they could also all rush in at once and probably capture the point. Never mind, they're probably not going to. Yep, we won. Oh, I walked directly into that. That was my fault, and now I'm about to die. Well, great start to the game, I guess. There's a Captain Deadbeard up here. I'm gonna go try to sneak up on him. Oh, this Cosmic Brains might make that kind of difficult, though. Okay, there we go. You should probably be dead now. Yep, now you are. Okay, Imp, you don't have much... Okay, never mind, I'm getting attacked. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna turn you into a goat. And that completely missed. I still killed you, though. I probably could have survived... Oh, that... There's another Imp. Hey there. Gonna charge up my shot and try to hit you. Okay, my aim is absolutely horrendous, but you still died, so that's good. Please don't notice me. That would be good. Okay, thank you. Now, if I could kill you without dying, that's all I need to do. Okay, I don't really care that this... I don't really care that I'm about to die. At least I killed that imp. Oh no, he's, ch he's chasing me. Okay, goat. That didn't work. Damn it. Ooh, there's two imps over here. If they don't notice me, then... I could probably kill them easily. Nice, I got one. If I could help out with this other one, that would be nice. I'm just gonna go in there with my Arcane Enigma and try to kill it. Oh wait, they got revived. That's not good. I'm probably dead. Yeah, I am. Oh no, I've been noticed. Okay, luckily there's a corn over here to help me out. Ooh, Captain Deadbeard, you are probably a little low since... Okay, well, this isn't good. I'm... I don't really like my chances here, so I'm just gonna run away. I feel bad for ability spamming, but I am trying to survive, so I don't really care. Oh, there's two mechs! There's two Z mechs! And a scientist! I'm dead. Okay. You are probably low, so get over here. I know that imp is definitely low on health. 
because I hit it like two times for 20. Come on, please, please, please. Damn it. I wish I could have seen how low that imp was. I'm actually going to make use of my abilities and gotify you so that your hitbox is a little bit bigger. But it doesn't matter because I'm dead now. Actually, wait, are the goat's hitboxes bigger than the imps? I mean, I would assume so since they look bigger than the imps. Oh, the game just ended. Ooh, Zombopolis. This will be nice since we're plants and we're going to be attacking. Okay, all right, please. Thank you. I thought I wasn't going to be able to go on plants because it was too full, but luckily it's not. Ooh, wait, since we're attacking, I can build a teleporter. I can actually be useful to my teammates. Uh, are you coming towards me? Okay, you aren't. That's good. And I'll summon these little crystal thingies. I don't really know what they're called, but I'm just summoning them in. Ooh, we're already capturing it. That's nice. I might as well go in and help capture it. I guess I'll help out with reviving you. Oh! Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna go for the portal, but those super brains have noticed me. And so is that Captain Deadbeard. I am not in a very good position right now. Oh, damn it. That super brains is going over there where the portal is. Can I hit you through the fence? I'm not so sure if I can. I think I can since it looks like my projectiles are going through. What is that? Oh, it's breakfast burns. I was really confused on what the sloppy noises I was hearing were. There we go, I got it. I might die here, but good thing I got the portal set up. I've noticed there are quite a bit of Captain Didboots on their team. Just a random thing I noticed. I'm gonna go in and try to capture the point. If my teammates could come in and help me, that would be nice. Okay, that sounded kind of sassy. I wasn't trying to be sassy, I just meant that in like a I, I want help type of way. I don't think that made sense, but uh, I want help is what I'm saying. Because we ca we captured that first point so easily and now we're, we're kind of struggling here. Hopefully we can still do it, but there are a lot of zombies nearby. I'm really hoping we can capture this because I don't want to end this game off just by capturing one capture point. Die, please, die, die, please, please. I just want to capture, thank you. I'm going to try to capture as much as I can before I die. Ooh, we're pretty close to capturing it, but the timer is getting low, so I'm hoping we can still do this. Ah, uh, damn, I don't think we're gonna do this. Ooh, come on, come on, overtime, please? Damn it. Well, that was a good game. All right, it's time to rank Frost Rose. I really liked Frost Rose's primary weapon because I didn't find it too hard to freeze people, and also because she has a homing ability which made it easier to hit people. Another thing I liked about her is that she was able to charge up her shots, so if you sneak up on someone and hit them, you could deal 50 damage to them before they even notice you. Also, this doesn't affect the rating too much, but I just want to say that Arcane Enigma was a really useful ability while I was playing. For these reasons, I'm going to be giving Frostros an A tier. Anyways, that's going to be the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. Comment down below if you agree with my rating or not. I don't have anything to say other than that, so anyways, yeah. See ya!